Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to bookmark a web page. Now I'm going to show you how to do this in Chrome, Internet Explorer, Firefox, and Safari. For those of you that aren't familiar with web page bookmarks and what they do, basically it's a feature your web browser has which allows you to save a copy of a web page URL or a website address so that you can go back to it later without having to type in the URL or the web page address. All right, I'm going to start with Chrome. So I'm going to go to a website that I want to bookmark. Once you get to the website that you want to bookmark, all you're going to do is press Ctrl and D at the same time on your keyboard. Once you do that, this window will pop up it says bookmark, it shows the name of the web page, and it shows what folder it's going to save to. So right now it's set to save to the bookmarks bar. So the bookmarks bar is this bar up here. You can also save it to other bookmarks and you can choose another folder. I'm just going to leave it on the bookmarks bar and I'm going to press done. Now to go to the web page that you just bookmarked, all you have to do is click on it on the bookmarks bar, which is this bar here. So if I click on it here, it's going to go directly to the website. Another way you can access it is by clicking on this icon here and then going to bookmarks. And you should be able to find your bookmark in here. As you can see, here's a list of all the bookmarks that I have on my computer. So again, all you're going to do is click on it and it's going to go directly to the website. Now I'm going to show you guys how to do this in Internet Explorer. So again, I'm going to go to the web page that I want to bookmark. Once again, I'm going to press Ctrl D on my keyboard. Once I do that, this window opens. It says add a favorite, and it says the name of the web page, and it says create in. Now create in is the same as the folder that it's going to save to. So currently it's set to save to favorites. You can also set it to favorites bar, Toshiba, or Toshiba recommended sites. Now depending on the brand of laptop that you have, these last two options are probably going to be a bit different. And you can also create a new folder to save the bookmark to. All you have to do to create a new folder is click on new folder, then type what you want to call the new folder. So I'm just going to call it bookmark and then select the folder that you want to save the new folder to. So you can save it to Favorites, Favorites Bar, Toshiba, or Toshiba Recommended. Then all you would do is click on Create. Now since I don't actually want to create a new folder, I'm just going to cancel that. So I'm going to click on Add. Now to access the bookmark that you just created, all you have to do is click on this little star right here. Now select the web page you just bookmarked, and it should go directly to it. Another way you can bookmark a web page in Internet Explorer is just by clicking on this icon here and it says add to favorites bar. So that's going to add the web page to this bar up here. So I'm going to click on it and as you can see it automatically adds it to this bar. To access the bookmark all you have to do is click on it and it goes directly to the website. Now I'm going to show you guys how to do this in Firefox. Now I'm going to go to the web page that I want to bookmark. Once again, I'm going to press Ctrl D on my keyboard. So that opens this window. It says edit this bookmark, remove bookmark, it shows the name of the bookmark, and it shows the folder that it's going to save to. So you can save it to bookmarks toolbar, bookmarks menu, unsorted bookmarks, or you can choose a different folder. And you can also add tags. I'm just going to save it to the bookmarks toolbar, which is this up here. To access the bookmark, all you have to do is click on it if you saved it to the bookmarks toolbar. Another way to access it is by clicking on this icon here, and then going to show all bookmarks. Now select the folder you saved it to, 
So I saved it to bookmarks toolbar, so I'm going to click on that, and here it is right here. Right click on it, and select open, open in a new tab, open in a new window, or open in a new private window. So if you click on open, it's just going to open it in the current tab. Another way you can access it is by pressing Control, Shift, and B on your keyboard. And this goes directly to show all bookmarks. Now I'm going to show you how to do this in Safari. So once again, I'm going to go to the web page that I want to bookmark. Press Ctrl D on my keyboard. Now this window opens and it says add this page to reading list, top sites, bookmark bar, news, popular, bookmarks menu, Imported IE Favorites. IE stands for Internet Explorer. Links, Toshiba, and Toshiba Recommended Sites. Once again, depending on the manufacturer of your laptop or the brand, these two options at the bottom might be different. Alright, I'm going to select Bookmarks Bar. So that's going to be this bar up here. And I'm going to click Add. To access the bookmark, if you saved it to the Bookmarks Bar, all you have to do is click on it. Another way to access it is by clicking on this icon here. It says Show All Bookmarks. Now select where you saved the bookmark to. Right click on it and select Open, Open in New Window, or Open in New Tab. If you select Open, it's going to open in the current tab. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you in my next video.